weather forecast, head on over to KMGK.com. All right, Carson, thank you. It's time to head back out to Neil Barton for this week's Small Town Live. For our first stop of the month, he's made his way out to Lake Jacksonville. Now, Neil, I hear you're in good company. Do you have the mayor of Jacksonville with you? His Honor is here right now. We've been talking, putting our minds together like he needs my help at all. Come on, His Honor. Come through here. So, first of all, have you thought about it maybe making this month a hotter than a burning stump? Or you had your own uh, ad lib? You know, I think that would be a great idea. Yeah. Yeah, I, I should issue a proclamation of that. Please do. Send me, a, send me that before we'll it on television. Okay, okay? we'll do that. Absolutely. Can you, can you tell me about this beautiful lake? You know, Lake Jacksonville was impounded in 1957. Uh, it was kind of a controversial issue back then. The city fathers felt like we needed a water source for sure. the town, uh, but they did it, and it has 65 years later. It's probably the best decision that our city fathers have ever done. It is gorgeous. Yeah, it really is. Uh, the the land values out here are just extraordinary. Uh, so it's, it's truly the supply and demand in effect. We love the city of Jacksonville because we first started our television station in Jacksonville. Yeah, exactly. License, so we're sucking up here. Yeah, the, 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 the kids need shoes, we need the work. So anyway, okay, but Jacksonville's on the move right now. You go through the main yeah, street there, lots of it tearing down and lots of building back exactly. up. Exactly. Yeah, we've got a lot of great momentum right now. We've got a wonderful city manager uh, and our, our JEDCO president. Uh, you know, we just decided there's no reason to continue to stand still. We want to progress forward and try to keep up with the Tyler and those uh, towns that are moving forward. So that's this, what we're trying to do. This lake is so gorgeous, but some of the facilities around here, as we've talked about before, are a little long in the tooth, like some of us, right. but before long, a huge facelift. Yes, that's true. Uh, we applied, it's kind of a crazy deal, we applied with Texas Parks and Wildlife for a $500,000 grant. Uh, they oh. liked our plan so well, they came back and said, we'll give you a million, too. Well, hey, <laughs> so, I should get a hold of them. Yeah, exactly. The government with a big <laughs> That's right. Book. So we're going to build, we've got a two, uh, two sleeve boat launch yep. over here. Saw that. We're going to redo that, put some uh, launch stations out. We're going to add another two, uh, another two lane mm -hmm. boat launch over here, redo the uh, fuel system. Yeah. Uh, we're going to build a, a, a re really nice air conditioned bath. Bathroom, yeah, good. And just do a lot of improvements. Now, here. Don't give it away yet, but in October you guys also have a big event coming up. We'll talk about that at six o'clock tonight. But again, thank you. Think about the proclamation. Okay. Uh, hotter than a two-dollar pistol. Yes. I still like the stunt, maybe a pot of collard greens or whatever. Okay. But we'll talk about that at six o'clock. Okay. All right. Thank you. We'll His honor, back. appreciate it.